Good evening, everyone. I'm Tassinix. Welcome to uh, week one, round three of season 23, three, uh, three versus three Grand Arena Championship for Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. My opponent tonight, Draz, Jedi Master of my guild, Shadowlands Vanguard. So, uh, Draz and I, we talk shop about Gak all the time. So it's going to be a tough match for me just because we, we trade a lot of, you know, of knowledge about uh, what to try here. Um, whether it's 3 versus 3 or 5 versus 5. Last time we met was in a 5 versus 5 season. Not this one, but the one prior. And uh, I made a complete mess of it. Just had bad attacks off to get. Made bad decisions that cascaded into worse decisions. And he was able to clear me and I was not close to clearing him. So... Definitely went south on me last time. Hey, Emmett, good to see you out there. How you doing? Happy Sunday to you. Cheers. Hmm. Now, they're probably not here right now, but a couple days ago, Zerkthan followed the stream. So thank you out there, Zerkthan. You might not be here today, but you are appreciated. All right, let's get uh, the hotbot comparison on screen to get that done as usual. All right, so um, comparing us, man, his stats are just straight up better than mine, right? Everything that matters, offense wins, under, defense, and clears. He's just got me beat all the way around. Zetas, he's got me by about 13. Um, we're right about the same top 80 GP. Good job matchmaking. Mod analysis, so I have more six dots than him, a, couple, a few hundred more, actually. Uh, three more plus 25s. Um, about 10 more 20 to 24s, uh, 12 more plus 20s, and then I have a handful more in the 15 to 19 and uh, 15 plus categories. Um, he's got me. He's got an edge on me in 10 plus and 10 to 14. Uh, seven more uh, offense percentage uh, secondary mods, uh, having you know, gosh, six percent or greater. I guess it's actually really dope mods. Uh, which makes sense when you look at a couple of his characters, because they're absolutely bonkers, completely cracked out of their minds. Uh, anyway, relics. I've got a few more relics. Uh, we both have a t uh, relic 9. I have 34 relic 8s to his 32. And let's compare our top characters. Um, Alright, so my Lord Vader is a thicker boy than his. Uh, thicker and faster, so I put, I put more effort into this one than other characters of mine. Um, his JMK is screaming fast. Look at that. And actually, it's pretty tough to have your JMK have health as high as his is. So that is absolutely incredible. Uh, incredible. Plus 201. That's got to be among the very fastest speed sets I've ever seen. All right. Uh, cat. My cat's faster. All right. C. My C is thicker and faster. So we got that going. Uh, JML, he's got me by four. 565 is a great spot. The offense is good. The potency is good on his. Um, yeah, that is very serious business. Really good. Great modding. All right, Ray. I made some changes on Ray. So Ray's a bit faster now, a bit more damage, a bit less health. Um, you know, so slightly more damage. Uh, <laughs> hey TJ, welcome. So you guys might have, uh, been, if you've been watching for the last couple of weeks, I, I had TJ5270 as an opponent here a couple weeks back, and uh, he was kind enough to um, to join Shadowlands Vanguard. So, you know, we had a, an opening, and he has a great roster and a great attitude. So good to have you with us, TJ. Uh, real pleasure. Let me see here about where I'm at in Discord. Okay, there we go. There we go. All this makes sense. Do, do, do. Okay, now we can go back to the main scene, I guess. All right. Anyway, we, we didn't really have too much left to cover there over in the mods, right? Um... Gosh, my slacker was a good bit faster. I guess we can go back real quick. We'll pop, we'll pop back over and finish that up. All right, so slacker was a good bit faster. Um, my gas, 
is slower, a bit more, bit more offense, but check this out. Huge stats, right? Look at, look at 9,700 offense on 76,000 health and 121,000 protection. This is incredible modding for this gas. Uh, I absolutely love it. Very nice stuff. All right, and then he's got uh, DR at 321, so he has him slow. Decent amount of offense, though. Uh, the key characters. Nothing too interesting in here. JKR is a little faster than mine. Thrawn's a little faster than mine. Okay, his GBA is a little slow. I doubt I'll see it on defense, though, so not to worry. Dear God, look at the mods, man. Like, I might have a few more 25-plus um, speeds or, or, uh, than he does, but look at these. He's got at least five plus 28s. That's crazy, man. That's absolutely crazy. Um, all right, so the top five. Okay, wow, look at this quill, guys. 360. 360 quill. That's serious business. Um, Lord Vader 560. Gideon 367 is really nice. Um, gosh, I'm actually kind of jealous of that. That's good stuff. All right, let's get back to the chat. Uh, Johnny Boy or Johnny B 65. Evening. How you doing, man? Don't know what you guys might be drinking here to close out your weekend. Uh, I'm having myself one, so get, uh, get strapped in because we do have some work to do here today. All right, we're back over at the scene. Let's uh, get into it. All right, so Draz has done us the kindness of doing his attacks first. Let's go over how this went. We'll do it in the and since he's already completed um, pretty much what I think is all of his attacking, we'll go over where uh, what, you know, what the business was. So we had Ray Cato three up front, Dr. BSF Malik, Gas Echo Arc, Lord Vader Shore, and uh, Royal. And then CLS 2PO, C3PO. And we snagged him on the CLS, guys. He had to two-shot that one. Um, let me give you the banners on those real quick, since I did have Nightbot pick that up. All right, so against Gas, it was 50. Raycat was 54. Lord Vader was, I think, 52. And Darth Revan, 51. It's one of those things where PrimeBot, like, said, they got 103. It just, like, gave me two of them at once. So I, I guesstimated 52 and 51. And then 32 for CLS. All right. So he came and, and he kind of ping pong between the top and back, uh, you know, top front and, and this rear zone here, thinking about how he wanted to go about clearing everything. So um, GG he took out for 54. Finn and the Vet Bros he had to two shot, and that was 32. Malmara Sidious was 54, uh, Bosk Boba Dengar was 53, and uh, JML here, that was the surprise, right? So I put two up front, and then JML in the back. And uh, he, he said that, you know, he made an error going against this, and then he it just got out of control, got away from him. So, I, I mean, this is very similar to what I had happen to me, except I didn't clear anywhere near as much as he did. So let's go and talk about the top side. Um, yeah, Johnny, I, I'm sorry I didn't see you in chat there. Yeah, I'm doing well, man. It's been a good weekend. Um, you know, good things, good things happening. Uh, let me go ahead and respond to a, a couple of DMs here real quick. Sorry. All right. Back to it. All right, so up top here, uh, Hux. Yeah, let me give you the banners on that. Hux he got for 52. Uh, Newt Django B1 was 52. Nest and the Resistance Brothers picked up a hold for us, and he cleared that for 34 on the second go. Rex Zeris Fives was 53. And Dooku Droidica Wampa was 54. All right, so we got a hold uh, in each zone. You know, multiple holds on the JML, but all this went pretty well, right? And then Fleet. Fleet, uh, he did pretty good here, actually. I mean, he one-shot Executor. Granted, he got, like, 54 doing it, if PrimeBot is to be believed. Um, let me double-check that. 
138 minus 186 is 52. So yeah, and then he 52 the negotiator. So low banner one shots, but not bad, not bad. Um, hmm. And just uh, another quick second, guys. Sorry, I'm getting a ping from a fleet shard mate that wants me to weaken so he doesn't have to beat me up. Um, man, that sucks too because I want to. Uh, Man, I wanted to take advantage of that. Um, damn. All right, well, I'll have to do that some other time to pick up those last couple of uh, clears. All right, let's go ahead and get this out of the way. Okay. Got to help your shard mates, people. Help your shard mates. All right. So, uh, let's start talking about his defense. This top side's pretty formidable. We've got GGB2 Magna, Embo Boba Dengar. I like this Embo. And how's the modding? Okay, so just, just kind of filler mods. Just trying to make do. All right, I see that. And it's way of the Qzo he has uh, Zayda not to lead. All right. Gas Echo Arc. I got a couple ideas about how I want to handle this, but it really depends on what I see in the back. I might just Sith Eternal this if I have the luxury. Um, Huck, Lobster Trooper, and Faust, he's got down, and then Dooku, Droidica, and Nest. So I had Wampa with mine, he put Nest with his. Uh, both are fine choices, Nest is probably strictly better, so it's good stuff. Hey, Valor, how's it going? Lord Ryan, how you been, man? Haven't talked to you in a couple days. Uh, last I heard, you you weren't feeling well. Hope, hope you're feeling better. Hope that's all behind you. Uh, your opponent one-tapped everything you had set for 33-21 total. Did you go super light? Like, you know, this guy have you intimidated? Did you keep too much for offense? What happened? Because 33-21, man, it's, it's like he just ran right through you. All right, so for this bottom wall, Newt, B1 Django, can't hate that. I mean, we run it ourselves. CLS, Chupio, C3PO. We have it ourselves. DR, BSF, Malik. We do that. Maul, Sidious, uh, sorry, Maul, Scion, and Nihilus. You don't see this one every day, guys. I, I had to think about this a little bit, but I think I've got a plan for this. And then it's Lord Vader, Darth Vader, and Royal. Um, I just want to point out a couple things here. So it's all 6A, right? So this is pretty good stats. And don't let the the fact that it's not a health set there fool you. 13.8% armor from this set is pretty significant. Uh, that's a lot of mitigation. I don't know what's actually better just to have the straight health, because you, you would figure the health because you have a synergy with the leadership that increases max health. So you'd think that would be better, but defense might be really good. Either way, I'm sure it's serviceable, but Here's the thing to laugh at, guys. Look at this Vader, right? Full 6A mods. Let's see what's up, yeah? 68,000 health, 53,000 protection, 260 speed. He's got the crit damage triangle, 89% potency. So not crazy, but he's in a crit chance set. What do you expect? 10,141 damage. Like, I don't know that I have ever seen a Darth Vader this high. This is absolutely bonkers. Crazy damage. And then being under the Lord Vader lead, he, he is going to be all kinds of terrifying. So that's that's pretty interesting. Okay, so Ryan, you answered my question. You put two GLs on defense. You had Ray, Cad, Vandor, and JML, JK, JKR set on defense. And he saved every GL for offense. Oh, well, then hopefully you can run through him pretty well. Um, be careful, you know, be careful about your attacks. But it's, it doesn't sound like anything unmanageable for you. So I believe in you. You can do it. Um, oh yeah, man, I for, you know, I always leave the combat music on when we're in uh, the pre-combat state, guys. I gotta not do that here. You know, we gotta, we gotta save the music for the times. Hey, Stone, how you doing? I was just thinking about you here tonight because uh, I'm planning to use that one counter you, uh, you told me about a couple seasons back, and I do get used for it. Alright, so here's the thing. This Darth Revan is 321 speed. Pretty slow. Yes, lots of health. I'll grant you that. 86,000 is a lot of health for a Darth Revan. This is a 285 speed Basil Sean Fall. Again, lots of health. 98,000 health. It's a lot. But no extra crit avoidance. This isn't a crit avoidance arrow and 285, right? So I'm thinking that this is trooperable, guys. 
Um, I want to I want to start off with some good mojo though, right? And I want to avenge myself for last round having my RJT BB8 R2 fail on a CLS 2PO C3PO that had no additional tenacity modding. I just got completely screwed on RNG. Um, it was bad. I was bitter. I was pretty bitter. Let's go ahead and get this one rolling, though. Uh, Resistance is the faction I'm looking for. And R2 and go. Uh, oh yeah, wait, combat music, right? That was the whole point. There, now we started the combat music at a dramatic moment. All right. Bad Batch works great on this too, says Belor. I appreciate that, man. Um, it's interesting to try and find what, what the uppermost limits of Bad Batch is, right? Still want to go right after him. We'll do the Jason Bell's game. Alright, people who are still dazed. Didn't get the stun in. It's a bummer. Alright, basic. Alright, he still got the daze. That is good. Um, he still got ability blocks, so let's go ahead and do the fire. Yeah. We'll do the pushback here. He's, he did the stance dance, so he's in the lower tenacity stance. Um, yeah, that's what I thought. Right there. Both get dispelled, that's fine. Okay. That's stunning. Oh yeah, guys, we're, we're in real good shape here now. Great if we can stall this out for a while. Fifty-three is quite good enough, though. That will do. Okay, fifty-three. Mark that green. Nice start to the evening. So Belor says you can use Hunter Tech and Echo and wreck CLS no matter the tenacity. That will. That's now. That's interesting, guys. How about that? Um, you know. A lot of people will see the tenacity modding uh, on CLS and or Chupio with the Crit Avoidance Arrow and think to just bully through anyway. Apparently, there is a method here to get past all that. Hey Stone, thank you for the follow. Appreciate you, Stone14. Alright, um, Newt, B1, and Django. We're gonna just JKR, Jolie, GMY that. Nothing fancy about this one, guys. Let's... Hmm. That's what? 
That's basic, because bonus protection really doesn't do anything for us here, right? We just basic. call Yoda and top him over, right? So, 53. Not bad. Not bad. Alright, these went to plan. DRBSF Malik. Here we go. Here's Piet Dark. Off and away. Okay, um, Long Scion Nihilus, yeah, I don't know. Long Scion Nihilus, what am I gonna do about that one? Alright, my, um, my fleet guy there let me know that, uh, he's gone on ahead and done what he needed to do, so let me just reset my fleet so I don't get knocked down to oblivion. done with. Alright, back to it. So, um, Maul Sion Nihilus. Let me take a look at what my options are. Maul Sion Nihilus. Just check real quick about the mall teams in general. Right. Um, hmm. Don't want to use any of those. Don't want to do that. Hmm. No, that would probably take too long. Uh. What about Padme, guys? Would Padme work? Let's think about that. We would be able to put a buff immunity up, but pain would still force us to attack, right? Um, you know what might be better? That might not be enough damage to do that. Because the thing is, this, uh, this Nihilus is pure health modding, right? So just really, really big health. Although, thankfully, it's still just a speed arrow. But lots of health going on, so I don't want to mess around with it. Lord Vader, I think we're going to have to do uh, Slacker Docker Zombie. That seems like that's going to be our best option here. What do you guys think of that? 
let's go ahead and do Lord Vader, and I'll, I'll take any suggestions you guys got for uh, for what to do about that mall team. But I'll figure something out one way or the other. All right, let's get moving on this one. This is going to be crazy and painful. Okay. All right, so we got a lucky stun onto Vader. That's uh, super great, actually. Uh, we'll take advantage of that. Put a double basic on him while we still can, right? Stab again. It's actually going pretty well, right? Uh, still have to hit him, get another lucky stun. No, okay. Merciless about to go out. Unless the swipe kills? Swipe doesn't kill. Not quite yet, anyway. All right, Merciless, off we go. Bonk, and crush again. Lots of crushing action. All right. Big crush from him. Um, man, we're still two turns away. We got a lot of crush to sit through. I'm worried about that, to be honest. Just worried for everyone else, really. This is kind of nice, though. Uh, Alright, one more. Come on. Zombie, do it. Nice, guys, nice. We can do another swipe on Vader, lower his mastery further. Um, we can do a res here. I'm kind of comfortable with that. Top everybody off, all things considered. Tenacity down on him, super nice. Big hit with the basic. The stab. Vader is almost out of the game. Yeah, he's about to ult though, so. Here we go. Alright, so he ulted. Oh, 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 man. All right, so we just, we just eated Vader. That was pretty funny. Swipe some more. Swipe some more. It's pretty tough to beat, guys. Pretty damn tough to beat. He's still got the taunt. This is ideal. We can stab again. Keep stacking up Siphon. More swipe. Oh, yeah. Um, no need to do the heal here. It's absolutely crazy the amount of damage. Almost there, though. Man, Lord Vader does fill up that second ult charge pretty well, though, doesn't he? Alright, we'll heal up there. Great time for another swipe. This has all worked out pretty well, guys. I think we're in a good spot. Two minutes. Yeah, still lots of time. Really huge stacks. Oof. Let's, um... Let's go ahead and transform. Yeah, see? I don't want to have any surprises like that. Alright, so we got a big hit there out of him. Stab. Get him. Um, Alright, there it is. 47. A one-shot, not a priceless work of art, though. <sighs> one-shot uh, for 47. Okay, pretty good stuff. Yeah, I guess Padme works here. I don't want to use Geos there, that's for sure. So let's see what we got going, Galactic Republic-wise. So JKA. Alright. Alright, Stone, I believe in you. Might have to do this the hard way, but yeah. 
Um, should do the dispel. So that we're free of pain. It's kind of crap, to be honest. Alright, um. Go ahead and do the big hit. It's fine. Base so far. <laughs> oh, the dodges are amusing, though. Good lord. Alright, 52. Through the gate. Alright, let's see what manner of surprise he's put in the back. We only had one GL up front, right? So what's what kind of monstrosity awaits us back here? Alright, so we see JMK, right? JMK cat, yep. Alright, alright. I see you, man. I see you. Okay. So... Rex Fives and Shock T. This is interesting. All right, well, let's at least pen all these in. GBA, Relic 8 Spy, Monster, Soldier. Um, Rex Fives, Shock, Zerus, Mandor, Zalbar. So that's a timeout. Padme, JK, Ahsoka. And... JMK, Cad, GK. Okay, so we have our own JMK to overpower something. We have that option, but for this, man, I don't know. I don't know that uh, we're, we're going to have a tough time here with this, aren't we? Because I'm going to need to use, like, GBA here, aren't I? GBA is going to be the way. How else am I going to provide him the kind of t uh, see the kind of time he needs? So I'm not going to have my normal Geos team. That's a bummer. And none of these teams. So I can maybe exploit one of these teams for that uh, fee. I'll try and do that. Maybe. We'll see how it goes. All right. So for JMK, it's going to have to be... See what, and then you want to think about what are you going to do when your tank gets insta gibbed and that should be brute. So that's what we'll do. Uh, see what GBA. It's kind of a bummer, but we've got a couple extra teams, so I think we'll be okay in the end. Plus I have like Poggle, Spy, Soldier if I super need somewhere. We can make a, a desperate ploy against one of these teams. But I think this is our best way forward, so here we go. Okay. Tank tech out to sea, of course. Alright, Link. And then I'm going to link uh, JMK because that's actually going to charge our ult the fastest, right? Okay. Um, I'm thinking it's probably best for you to have this. Actually, wouldn't it be best for Brute to have it? No, 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 because we want you to be full in the event that you have to summon someone else. So we'll, we'll think of it that way. Alright. Got our Brute back. We can basic here. Keep the, keep the faith, my friend. Oh, man, did you just see how hard they just blew out that poor Brute? Okay, Watt's done his service to us. Lots close to be. Oh man, we're in a we're in for it now, aren't we, guys? Um, no point in doing this right here. They're cutting right through all of my protection. Right, this is the super bummer. Now is the chance to do the drop. We got to do the drop. So we'll hopefully drop buffs. Yes, it gives us just a little reprieve. But 
honestly not enough. They, this, they're cutting through me so hard. Uh, God, that's nasty. Might not be able to clear this. Because if we, yeah, if we die there, yeah. Cutting through the protection is bad news, guys. So, we preloaded that, and that's really our best attempt at doing it. So, we'll have to say that we have to be better everywhere else, because I don't think I get a second attempt at that. We'll comment it up and say that um, after ult, JMK team was able to cut into C health uh, and ignore all protection. So that is a bummer, guys, but it was the best we could do. All right, let's think about how we're gonna tackle top. So, man, this this uh, gas is so serious. I'm worried about him. Um, we don't have Sith Eternal now. Hmm. Where was Treya going to get used? Maybe there. Or who else was going to take care of the nest for me if not Treya? How is that nest modded real quick? It is tenacity, damn. All right, well, let's do GG. We know the script for that one. That is Mon Mothma, Cassian, and K2. So, let's roll. Man, that was tough against that uh, JMK in the back with C. I don't think I've tried that before, but it, it went about as well as I thought. Um, Lord Vader seems to take up Slacker. Like, JMK Cat, I guess, is what Draz used against uh, my Lord Vader. Because he got, like, a 54 on it, so not a lot of things are doing that. All right, there. We got the ability block out. Okay. Try and land days. Hey, we got the days. Pretty nice. Not that it matters too much. With the magnet having just this, this, this no. having just dispelled it. Um, no, we won't do the heal here. Not yet. Keep up with the grenades. That's nice stuff. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting somewhere. We'll just basic that, yep. Um, good time to do the heal. So now we get the offense and you're the defense penetration rather. Yeah, that's rough. That is a lot of damage. It takes a while to restore this K2, man. He's taking a lot of punishment. Definitely gonna get in the time for that second heal. Uh, first time chat from our opponent here, Draz. Use Slacker versus Lord Vader for 50. Ray versus Ray for 54, JML mirror timeout. Okay. Yeah. Pretty nice, man. Here we go. 53. Nice. The other day it was a white, but 53 will do here today. Alright. Um, hmm. What am I gonna do about these teams in the back? Rex fives. Rex, Rexley. What am I gonna do about that? I gotta think about some of these. Um, and then, yeah, this gas team. Hmm. There's a couple ways to go about it, but I don't like it. It's not great. 
Might be able to scan my way around this one. What's your contract again? Damage an enemy without buffs 15 times. Yeah, I think there's a Bad Batch path through that, something like that. So we'll keep Treya for you just to deal with Nest, if nothing else. This one, this one, we'll use uh, Stone Strategy. I think that'll work just fine. It's this, this, and this, and we'll hit the gas on that. Thanks for sharing that, though, Dress. Really interesting. Appreciate you. Um, we'll go ahead and boost you up the big hits. Get that wagon train. Sweet. Get the ability block. Absolutely glorious. Uh, get a big hit. We'll get turn meter back. Ball. Nice. Really nice, guys. Uh, keep it moving on the hugs. Doesn't have any buffs, so this is just absolutely brilliant. There we go. That's nice stuff. Uh, ability block again. Perfectly descript. Down with ability block. It's wonderful. Lots of damage here for Mesra. Super clean. 54. Shock. What am I gonna do about that Rex team? What am I gonna do about you? Mm, that might be the team I end up using JMK on, maybe. Although, that's an attractive option. We could do that. Um, yeah. I don't see a reason why that wouldn't work. Big hits and all. Okay. We'll pen that in. I'll mull it over here in secret beforehand, but we'll say that that's you guys. Padme, JKA Ahsoka. I don't see that on defense too much. Let me think about that one real quick. Hmm. Maybe something with Vader. Maybe EP Thrawn Vader. I like that. That could work. Zerus Vandor and Zalbar. Zerus Vandor and Zalbar. Zerus Lee. Zerus Lee is uh, health, isn't it? Doing stuff. That, yes, yes, Dagger. Things are uh, moving along here tonight. Not lagging as much as usual. Um, what? What? Geos. How do I want to handle Geos? Uh, what was Zerus lead again? Let's check about that. Lots of health. 10% max health. Jedi allies and other allies heal for 4% of her max health. So 124,000, just say, times 0 0.04. So they're healing for 5,000. Okay, it's, it's a good amount. Um, let's think here. GBA. Got to come up with the rest of this plan here. Well, where does um, where does Bad Batch go? That's going to be a good question. Who's the fastest here? We could. So 281. 202. 10,000, 112% crit chance, no less. Wow, that's 
That is pretty serious for a spy. Of course, he relocates, so it'd be weirder if he didn't have all that going on. Yeah, this is nice. All right. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. I got a stew on that one. Bosk and Mando um, on Barris. You know, Aura Grief Bosk could do well there. I think I'd have them penned in for a different team. Hold on. Aura Grief Mando, rather. Okay, I like that. That that would work. I have Aura Grief Mando, and that would do good. I just need to think about something else to deal with this Embo team, which seems like that should be easier. Um, Geos. Let's think here about Geos real quick. Hmm. That's unfortunate. We could try Jawas. We could. It seems disrespectful. But we could. And we have a little margin to work with, right? Um, Jawas. Jawas is an option. And then what do we do here? So where is JMK going? So if I do something like Jawas here with Geos, and I've taken the Embo, so I can find something easier for Embo. Like I could move like Kirahan Chewy into the position of Embo, and then against Gas, I guess I could use JMK. That seems like the most worthy use of Gas here, right? Yeah, Geos get used against this, Bounty Hunters get used against this. That makes sense. What did I have pending there? Yeah, right. So, hmm. No, that seems like a pretty good deal, Jeff, banners wise. Um. What's the answer for Embo, guys? I need to think about that here real quick. Let's stew on the rest of these. So if we do that, then I have Bam Quill IG-11. Bam Quill IG-11. Um, we'll go ahead of them. And then what? We can't be ability blocked, but we can be killed. Okay. We still have things like Mother Talzin, so yeah, I guess we can do JMK something, right? JMK, some Galactic Republic, and GK against Gas. I guess that would work. And then we still haven't assigned Bad Batch, so Bad Batch might be our answer there. Bad Batch for maybe... I don't know if we want to do that to Jawas. Um, Let's think about it. All right, well, one thing's for sure. I think we're going to use um, JMK here on gas. So let's take a look at Galactic Republic Faction and see exactly how we want to do that. Uh, full clear for the Wind Dagger. If I can get through everything except his, JM his JMK on bottom and do it with less drops, then I might be in a good spot. But he one-shot my executor, so it might be a tall order. Not sure. Um, stun seems like a pretty good call to have along for the ride, right? Let's do that. But is this overkill? Let me check and see. Exactly. And if it is overkill, by how much? Yeah, people JMK cat this all the time. That makes sense. Yeah, this seems reasonable then if I'm doing it without cat. Let's do that then. Okay, Ayla, and GK. Alright, let's go. Beauty on our boy. Get to it. 
Um. Finally, a sit down. Let's uh, do the heal up and hope that we get enough damage done here. We don't have a lot of time to do very serious damage. Um, probably should do the heal here for GK, yeah? That's a bummer. We're going to have to put up with this a little bit. But I don't want to lose GK when Gas stands up right there. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want that drama. That's for damn sure. So let's get back to it. Stacking the damage on JMK is doing really well for us. Oof, oof. There's a the big hit that happened. Alright, it's real serious time now. Okay. Let's, um... Let's call her. Okay, that's good too. Woo! Look at him just take on this galactic legend. Absolute madness. 40% health, 30% protection, and gain foresight. Seems reasonable, given our situation. Okay. This is crazy, guys. Look. Oh my god, the damage. Okay. Definitely taking the heal here. Up. All right, just being careful for working out for us, guys. Big hits, there it is. 47. Jeez, that gas was serious. All right. Dooku, droid, to nest. Treya would be a real good one. Um... Yeah, we could easily stun people with tech, right? We could do, like, Hunter Echo tech and pretty easily control that Dooku team. We could do that. Hmm. Yeah, the stun would also be really helpful against the uh, GBA team. Hmm. Couple different ways to skin that. Let me think about what what are our actual remainder teams. So we have Vader, we have Yeah, I do have Bam, so I don't have to use like Bam Han Chewy against Gas, which can work. Uh, might not have worked there though. That was an extremely well modded gas. That could have been a nightmare. Uh Embo, Boba Dengar. What's an appropriately weak team for that? Maybe Bam Quill IG-11? So if that's the case... We could save Bam as a cleanup for something, right? But it's not that good as a cleanup. It's good against a fresh team. Because you need to be hitting multiple targets to gain all your turn meter and stuff, so... Hmm. Nest. 
I guess that Kira Han Chewie is fine for Embo Boba Dengar. Yeah, I think that'll do. What team are we selected on here real quick? Uh, what did we learn, Dagger? Oh yeah, no, right, right guys, isn't that crazy? Hey, hey Arthur, it's good to see you there, Backspace. Good to see you here, man. Um, appreciate your sub, thank you so much. Two months uh, with us. You're good, man. I, I appreciate you so much. And uh, by the way, if you guys like StarCraft, if you like to see uh, excellent Protoss play, follow my friend uh, Backspace. Let me do this. Shout out at Backspace. There you go. That's how we do it. All right. So, yeah, if you like StarCraft and you like Protoss, go check him out. He's a good guy. Um, Dooku, Droidica, this one. So, yeah. If we... Ray and Scion Nihilus. Yeah, I think that's gonna be fine. And this was the Dooku team I selected. Alright, let's do it. Let's just do Triumvirate and get it out of the way. Not have it hanging over my head. Okay, here we go. Oh, you're very welcome, Arthur. No problem. Anytime. Okay. Um, you won't be able to stealth anybody. For nest. Did hit. Boom. Just gone, though. People who were and then were not. Chapter 1. Okay. Man, the, the stacking offense on Trey is just monstrous. Goodbye. Oh, that's fine. 50 banners. It'll do. I want to come back for this Embo team. I'm worried. Uh, it's such a weak team that I want to make sure I have most potent things aside. So, Padme. Hmm. EP Thrawn Vader. Is EP Thrawn Vader gonna be better against Padme than Bamquil IG-11? They'll have the extra protection and stuff, but I don't... I still don't know that that matters too much. Hmm. Alright, we'll take on the other ones that I'm sure about back here. This Rex 5s thing. I'm gonna use JKL and Hoda just alone. Where you at, young man? Show yourself. Let's roll. That's right, Arthur. We're going alright. Yep, we're against a really strong opponent from my guild. Um, my defenses did well, but I still have to do all my own uh, all my own work here. Alright, now these guys are Stone Age to Eternity. It's gonna be hilarious! Seriously, my, my uh, JKL has like absolute lowest possible speed, like 112 speed, so it's gonna be great. He gets to go fast, they don't get to go fast. Ta da! Yes. They, they heal, alright, I can respect that, that's fine. Back up to Delete. Delete. Oh man. Yeah, you don't want none of that, I'm afraid. Yep. Not, I'm afraid not, sir. Or ma'am, as the case may be. Monk. Monk. 55. 
five. Mark that green. That's a nice one. All right. Um, the Ceres, we were gonna do the bounty hunters. Yeah, I like the sound of that one. For a grief Mando, let's roll. All right. <laughs> All right, Arthur, you gotta pop out. Take care, man. If you're starting your stream, I'll look you up when I'm done here. But take care, man, good luck. All right, Vandor, straight after Vandor. No mercy. Um, I'd rather stay the days. Stay stealth, stun, and we get countered. Um, basic. Get his armor shreds. Kind of a bummer. Basic you again. And he's got good tenacity, so we can't really stun him. But we did get our contract just now, so that's nice. Um, we will defeat Vandor so we can get around to our business. Yeah, there, there will be no stunning of this guy, will there? Okay, um, trying to get this done on you? No? Okay, well, you try. Ignore the taunt for a moment, maybe? Yes, okay. That's all good. Uh, we'll give you a heal here, give you a turn meter. Fine, it's all good. Three more turns until the next delete. No debuffs of any kind getting landed on this big boy. Alright, so she has no offense to speak of. We should be in the clear here to finish off with high banners. We'll probably just wait to do a third delete, if I'm being honest. Um, yeah. The mask and the pop. Bang 54. Alright, Padme. Pad Padme. That was funny. Uh, Bad Batch. Okay, so... They'll be able to dispel our tank. So, this is how this needs to go, right? We need to have Hunter, we need to have Echo, and we need to have Tech. Uh, we need Tech for the stun, right? And then, yeah, I think that's how this is going to work. So it's kind of an all or nothing with that. Um, Hunter, BB, Echo, Tech. Because by going in without a tank, you know, if things go south on us, it's going to go real south real fast. But I think we, I think we can make it work. I believe in the power of us. Okay. Throw the bomb and land in many stunts. You landed some stunts. Um, I'm grateful. That will do. We will do this. Okay. Kill it. Cut them to pieces. Um, hmm. What to do about this? Could do the turn meter swap. But I think it's into a basic, so let's just do that. Okay, so we took out the GVA. That's really the hardest part of this. Um, wow. Sent to the Stone Age. Nice. Whack. Take him out. There we go. Okay. That all went very, very smoothly. 50. Man, I love Bad Batch. They're so powerful. Um, okay, so we got a couple power teams left to consider. We got Kira Han, Chewie, and Bam Quill IG-11. I'm guessing Bam Quill IG-11 would do just fine here. Why would it not? Let's think about it. Well, Vader doesn't hit like he used to. We can definitely count on Bam to hit. 
Let's go for it. this buff until well no we do want to do this right yeah this is this is our whole spike so we might as well go forward from it um, yeah this is one of those that might just take some time to do I think so now we won't hit for much but you know it's on it's not much but it's on his work sort of thing um Yep, keep cutting. Keep cutting. Heal you up. Um. Okay, so there's that heal. Not a great situation for us to be in. Okay, so I think we're about to do the cycle again, right? Jeez. What a hit. Alright. Ooh, he revived. Oh, that was dope. I love that. Seven stacks? Uh, we're, we're making progress. Jeez, we can... oh, that's bad news. Can't be having too many of those. Come on. Ooh, finish him off. Can you finish him off? I don't know. Yeah, the heal have to back out, guys. We'll have to back out. Alright, so we burned up one there. First, let's mark the loss. Comment. Um... Not enough damage after two sets of birds to kill JKA got overwhelmed. That's about it. Alright, EP Thrawn Vader? Maybe that'll work for us? Let's give it a, uh, give it a go. We do get the crush, that is pretty nice. Um, do it on here, get it All right. Do this. that can't be evaded. Alright, stun. Alright, we'll fracture down. Lock her down. Let's wrap it up. Yep, should have done that right out the gate. Oh well. It's a little bit of my margin gone here for doing fleet. Fleet's where things can get hairy here, guys, because he one-shot both things, so I have a little bit of pressure. Hey, Shark Forge, I appreciate you making it over. I know you're, uh, you're on a uh, Max basis stream, but... I saw you follow me a little while back. Good to see you here tonight. How you doing, man? All's well that ends well over here. All right, 34. Yeah, so that would have been a 54 if we'd done that from the beginning. So that was super smooth, guys. Kind of a bummer. All right. All right, we're going to leave that JMK alone. All right, so that means against this Embo, we get to do our leader of choice. So we'll do Kira on Chewy and go. We'll see what we got waiting for us on fleets. Glad to hear you're doing well, Shark Forge. We're, uh, we're just about finished going through all the different squads um, on this team. Let me think about this here real quick. This should get an assist. Yeah, I was right about that. All right, pop. Wow, perfect. Absolutely perfect. You can't beat it with a stick. Mm -hmm. So that's a good dodge. 
That one doesn't get dodged. Ha ha! We'll put it on stuff. Oh yeah, this is going nice. All right, there we go. Fifty-three. Pretty smooth. All right, so in general, our attacks are doing pretty good. We just need to make a good showing here in fleets. All right, and what has our opponent set for us? So, Executor and then Chimera. Okay. And then... Maybe do Finalizer against that, since it's the single tank variant. I think we could make that work. Um, it would be Palpatine probably coming off the bench first. So maybe we could, maybe we should Rebels that instead, but no, we could, we could really be foiled. Let's think about this. You do the double tank so that you can't easily get finalizer. So I think I'm going to finalizer that one. All right, so let's do executor and get the harder fleet out of the way. We'll see what we have to pay to get through this. It's going to be a tough one. Uh, Shark Forge, he says, your problem with, you think your problem with games like this is that you would always build your team based on characters you like and not based on the synergy or capability. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, you can already tell there are so many cool characters in this. Yes, there's a lot going on in this game, and your instinct is right. I mean, if you want to be just a collector in this game, you could do that. And if you want to do that, I encourage you, don't spend any money on the game at all. Uh, because if you wanted to actually, like, enjoy winning things, and you just want to build whatever character, whatever way, you're going to have a bad time. So, yeah, there's, there's definitely a lot to learn here, though. It's a super fun game. Throw these in here. That's gonna be it, guys. Let's take the show on the road. Last two fights of the night, hopefully. Hopefully. By the way, guys, feel free to uh, get at me on my Discord, get at me on my YouTube. Uh, I put these GAC videos out there. Uh, I might make other content. You guys can tell me what you want me to make, and I, I'll consider it. Alright, so they took our Vulture. That really wasn't what I had. Wanted, but it'll do, I guess. Uh, yes, yes, thank you for killing all of my vultures. You dick. Alright, we're going after time now. Okay. Alright, so the question is who does Spy pick today? Is he going to pick the harder option or the easier option? Oh my god, he chose the easy option. We don't have to do this all the hard way, guys. Please die. Thank you for dying. Okay, so it'll take a, it'll take a good bit longer for them to get that contract on this way. Man, that's bad news for us. Yeah, that, that, is really, that really does not amount to much now, does it? Alright, we got to do this. Do the dispel. Probably going to kill our other um, vulture. This fleet, this the AI on this fleet does a good job going after the vultures, which, all things considered, is a pretty good idea. Doing fuzzies there. Okay, so we don't have um, breach on us anywhere, which means that we can call out Evan Hawk. Go after you. We don't get dodge, which is extra super slick. Being honest, that's nice. Yeah, we're doing a good bit of damage here, but. Here comes Boba. Boba's gonna have something to say. Okay, yeah, we're gonna take out one of our dudes. You're taking out some of my dudes. Neat. Alright, and now we have one turn to wait, right? That's pretty bumming. Maybe they go after this one vulture after it does one turn of glory. Would that be the case? Um, we could get... No, we can't really do anything to you. And I don't want you to counterattack me, so I am just going to put this on. Maybe that stays. Maybe it doesn't. It's like that. Oh, no assist from uh, Volker. Come on. Just a little love. Just a little love from the game. Come on. Just a little love. Okay, we have to do that. Yes. Here it comes. Okay. 
absolute crap that I have to sort of for this guy. Old style. We can lose that damn hyena before it takes a turn. Come on. You're killing me with that crap, guys. Go after him. Please. Finish. Oh my god. Okay, so who's who's next that's really gotta go? You've really gotta go, don't you? Yeah, seriously, Dagger, I hate the no assist. It's uh it's a real pain to me. There's nothing I can do about it. Come on, no assists, still no assists, all stun all the time. Yep, just get cranged out by that. Yep, yep, yep. Alright, so now we have to two-shot that one, so there's some of our margin. We're not running around with a lot here these days. This is not going to take much to sweep up, so we just want to be sure what we're dealing with down here. Relic Fives. Um, Imperial Tide Bomber. Let me check my records real quick. I want to make sure I remember this. I do these chimeras with home one all the time though. Let's give it a shot with home one. And this last ship won't be called, so I won't even pen that in. Let's go back over here, and I'll say home one. Um, let's mark up how this goes. So comment, um, no assists from vultures due to bug. So that was fun. Oh, yeah, let's one drop. Keep our syntax. One drop, malevolence. Okay. Mark is red. Okay. And then this one, I'm sure I'll just use finalizer to finish it up. Okay, so this is good. Let's roll out. This dude digs and hot. Yeah. Finalizer, no reinforcements. We can do the monster math and see where I'm at, like right after this. See if I have to make any difficult choices like that. Yeah, that's always fun. Thanks, asshole. Um, okay. Okay. Hey! Why couldn't we have that in territory battle? Or territory war, rather? Um. Here's the threat condition. Okay, so we force the heal. That's kind of nice. We can wiggle now since we don't have to worry about the fire. Try and finish off the baby there. Oh, real nice. Real nice. Okay. Um, not necessarily. Well, see, the thing is, if I bring out Cassie in the fight, that's right here. So we'll do that. We won't lose any rain again. No risk of losing banners about rain. So there we go. Alright, a couple of wasted banners from that point of view, but 65, so nice clear. Okay, so let's do the math real quick. <clears throat> Two seven two five plus one eight six is twenty nine eleven less twenty nine nineteen. Uh, so if I clear that territory, it's is that it's saying minus eight, so it means I need to get eight banners on this. Does that mean I kind of have this in the bag? Is that what that is that what that means? Um, bucks, first order one two. A win wins it for me? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Um, 
feels weird to run without at least the one. There are only two ships left. No opportunity to pop the contract, but if the mass assist goes bad on us and they kill one of the ships, I, I might not regret having this along, so I'm gonna do that. straight out of the gate. It's always so fun. Okay. Dispel you. Kill you. Uh, yeah. Go ahead and punch it. It's fine. Nice big juicy hit there. Oh, man. That is serious business. Um, still ability blocked. That's good. We don't need to be returned to Kylo here. We can't do that. Get some life restored. And a big hit. There we go. Alright, 45. Where are we at? Twenty-nine fifty-six to twenty-nine nineteen, guys. Uh, ugly. Neither one of us cleared the last uh, hidden GL in the back. But uh, I have avenged myself. Draz, if you're still out there chilling in the audience, uh, mad respect. Thank you for the really good match. Um, you got me last time. I got you this time. I look forward to seeing you next time. Damn good stuff. All right, guys. Uh, let's do the recap real quick. So he had uh, one drop in the front, one drop in the front, uh, top front, one in the bottom front. Um, no drops in the back, he one-shot Executor and um, Negotiator. And then in the back here, he had to two-shot the Finn team and then just wiped out here on JML. Um, for me, for my attacks, up front, we were flawless. No drops on this wall. And in the back, you know, what was waiting for us? We had uh, JMK sitting there, JMK Cat GK. And I went in with Sith Eternal, GBA, and Watt. And no, no joke, it was not close, it was not enough. Once, uh, once JMK got his ultimate off, they just all cut through underneath your protection. So what does it matter that you have all this protection? You just, I, I died with, you know, 0% health and 100% protection. What are you gonna do? So, I don't think I have anything left to reasonably chop at this. Like, we could, we could go at it with all these crap teams, but to be honest, guys, um, we've already got the match in the bag. And uh, I just know that this wouldn't work out. Like, this is the premier... This this right now is, like, the best single, you know, three team in the game, right? So I don't think I have a chance to clear that with anything less than the best. Uh, nonetheless, wow. Outstanding match. Yes, TJ, uh, I'm glad you enjoyed it. This was a hell of a good fight. Good way to finish out the week. A great 3-0. Uh, avenging myself. It's good stuff. Let's see who I'm going to send you guys to on Twitch, yeah? Hopefully the uh, raid feature works today. That would be nice if it did. Last time I tried to raid you guys out, that did not work. Let's send you guys off to... Hmm, let's go see Gom. Uh, yeah, we haven't seen Gom in a minute, so let's go do... Actually, you know what? Telomad uh, was talking to me though. the other day, and I don't think... I've raided him recently, so let's go ahead and get about that, yeah? Let's raid Telomag, because we've done Gamba Bunch, so... Gotta spread the love. Uh, Telo. Telo. There you are. Alright, guys, I am starting up the raid. Hopefully you go on out to see Telo. And, uh, you know, thanks for being with me this week, uh, especially here tonight on your Sunday night. Uh, great round. I'm so excited. I'll be on Discord here. I'm probably going to be playing a bunch of like League of Legends, Call of Duty Mobile until I go to sleep. So get at me if you want to do any of those things. All right. Take care, guys. Uh, see you on Wednesday. Peace.